Now let's talk about the readOS command line. The readOS command line reads a line of input from the console and you can use it to prompt a user for the input. Because you can save the input as a secure string, you can use this command line to prompt user for secure data such as passwords. And readOS command line has a limit of 1022 characters it can accept as input from a user. So let's see an example for this. Go to the PowerShell command prompt. And if you want to know the parameters of readOS command line, then we can take help of get help command line. So type get help read host hit enter. And here we can see readOS supports prompt parameter and as secure string parameter. Now let's try to get the input from the user and store it in a variable. And to declare a variable in PowerShell, use dollar and name of variable you want to give. So let's say password. And to read a line of input from the console, we will take help of read host command line. And let's prompt the user to enter the password. And for that, we will take help of prompt parameter here. So we can write PRO prompt and mention the message here. Let's say, please enter your password. Hit enter. Now enter the password. Let's say A, B, C, D and hit enter. As soon as the enter key is pressed here, the value is stored in the password variable. So let's verify and to verify, you can directly call the variable here, password and hit enter. And you can see the value that was entered A, B, C, D or you can do like this, write host and the variable name and hit enter, you can see the value that was entered by the user.